Hi, my name is Aaron Gerds, and I'm the Editor-in-Chief of Ash Clinical News. Welcome to this month's From the Desk Of. Well, the annual meeting has just wrapped up, and we've all returned to our respective institutions and uh, settling in for uh, uh, 2023 that will prove to be a very exciting year for the world of hematology. Likewise, we got a very exciting year starting for Ash Clinical News, and the very first issue for the year will feature an editor corner from Dr. Samuelson Banow. Also, we will feature our notes from the Hill, uh, so where our new hematology fellow uh, that will be an advocate for hematology and hematology issues on the Hill uh, will be sharing their experiences with us uh, in the pages of Ash Clinical News. We're also going to demystify the lab, looking at spe mass spectrometry. And in our Blood Advances in a Different Vein, we'll feature uh, an article published in Blood Advances about venous thromboembolism prophylaxis in sickle cell disease with a perspectives by Dr. Rocky Nake. So definitely a lot of great content in our January 2023 first issue of the year. Uh, but t headlining the issue is a feature on cultural sensitivity. And this has really been a hot topic, of course, over the last year and really should be foremost in our mind. Where we all take care of patients uh, and, and interface with people in general as part of our lives. There's no way to get away from people. And maybe if you live in a cabin in the middle of nowhere in Alaska, you can avoid people. Uh, but then you might also get a, a reality TV show. But uh, it's a whole other topic. But really, we interface with people all the time, whether you're in the clinic, in the lab, at a conference, uh, at an international meeting even, like the annual ASH annual meeting. And cultural sensitivity is something I think really, that's incredibly important when we interact with others. Not everybody has the same background and experiences that you may have. And understanding where people are coming from is the first step to uh, respect and collaboration. And at the end of the day, hematology is all about collaboration to making lives better uh, for people who are struggling with blood, blood diseases. So again, a, a foot, uh, something at the foot, at the cornerstone of all of this is, is cultural sensitivity. And so we're taking a little bit of cultural sensitivity, trying to familiarize with what's going on in the field of cultural sensitivity, uh, giving some quick tips and uh, uh, some, a little bit of information on terms that might be helpful for you. Uh, to really kind of bring you up to speed with what's going on. So again, all this and more in our January 2023 issue of ASH Clinical News. We're absolutely thrilled to bring you this issue on the heels of the annual meeting. Also, I'd like to point out that we will have on-site coverage throughout January uh, from the annual meeting, including things in print, online exclusive, as well as our video series uh, from, from the meeting, uh, meeting coverage. So again, Absolutely thrilled to be starting off 2023 with such a bang. Uh, it's a, been a pleasure to work with you over the course of 2022, and I look forward to things in 2023. So until next time, uh, keep the blood pumping.